Hey everyone, welcome back to Dave the Diver. We are in the finishing episode here, and last time we uh, battled the what turned out to be the last boss, the great white shark Kraus. The old lady, I don't remember if we got her name, she got her revenge after all. And uh, now we are just about to go and get our... I don't know actually if it's our last VIP, but we do have a VIP day today. And then we have a short session at the restaurant, and then we are hopefully going to be doing another diving session today as well. Hopefully we are going to get the last poor beagle shark, and hopefully we're going to get enough money to upgrade our, um, our drone to three uses. That would be very nice. And here we go. Let's see what kind of game we'll be up to today. It's not a cook-off, right? Is it? Is it a cook-off? Hello everyone, this is Yui from NDC Station. Ladies and gentlemen, as you know, today is the day of the final clash in Challenge the Chef. It is indeed a cook-off, and it is indeed the last one. Okay. Bancho, are you ready? Yes. How about you, Alex? Ready. My fingers are uncontrollably wiggling. Excellent. Then let's begin Challenge the Chef now. All right. Right, we're in the red corner apparently. At the cult, okay. How do we do that? Perfect. Well, so far so good. Roast the onion. Uh, hold X. Okay, good enough. Make a dipping sauce, okay. Perfect. Oh. Assume it just needs to be green. Perfect. We've done this one before, but it's probably different. All different looking fish, apparently. They're all whole fish. I think that's a... one of them was a vampire squid there. Perfect. That's gonna be it. Ooh, okay. That wasn't too bad. I gotta say... The, our competitor definitely went with uh, with a, a classic one. Of course, we were never in doubt. Neither was Bancho. Core 99, close enough. I don't remember what we got last time, but I think it was also pretty close, actually. What? Alex's fish and chips lost? Yeah, that was a pretty standard. Not standard, but classic. 
What an upset. My fries are the best in the Thank world. You. Yes, your fish and chips indeed tasted excellent. Incredible, actually. But what is the theme of this contest? The theme? It's fried dishes. Not quite right. The theme for this contest was Fry the Sea. Masterfully fried cod is good on its own, but that alone does not represent the sea. However, Bancho's dish was... What kind of soy sauce did you use? I added chopped green laver and added it to normal soy sauce. As I expected. I liked your shark and squid combination, but the, hi but the highlight was your soy sauce recipe. The soy sauce enriched with the flavor of the sea better represented the taste of the sea. What an impressive flavor. Your dish gave me a feeling of exploring the sea, from the coastal waters to the deep sea. That was a fabulous adventure. The texture of your fried dish was good as well, but the game changer was your soy sauce. Alas, my perfect fries were not enough to satisfy the judge. It was a close match. Let us hear what Bancho has to say. You need to be careful when making the soy sauce. That's thank you, Bancho. The champion prefers action over words, and we love it. And it's time to wrap up today's episode of Challenge the Chef. Today, Bancho won the contest. This is, wait a moment. I am pleased by today's contest, and I would like to give him a piece of advice. You, I see your menu is expanding, but the drinks you offer stay the same, yes? Because I am a chef, not a barkeep. You said the same thing before. Dining is a comprehensive experience. What do you pair up with your pasta? A glass of wine, a glass of cola, or just a glass of water? It will significantly change the dining experience. Your place cannot satisfy the various tastes of customers with a limited selection of drinks. This is my gift for you. It is a cocktail dispenser. Hmm, cocktails. They don't go well with the sushi though. Oh please, not every cocktail is sweet. You can make interesting cocktails using sake as a base. Well, of course, you are not in charge of drinks. That hungry looking guy. Hey, yes, you. Me? I will leave this cocktail dispenser here. You find out how best to use it. A gift from Vincent, a cocktail dispenser. Bancho Sushi will offer more menu items soon, and we can't wait to see what will be added to its menu. See you next time, this is reporter Yui. Okay, another drink we need to learn. Cocktails. This dispenser is designed to serve three different cocktails at the same time. Well, I am not familiar with cocktails, but come to think of it, this is like a drink version of Omakase. Yeah, that makes sense. It's our job to serve drinks customers want. Why don't we make more money by adding cocktails to the menu? Okay. Oh, we completely forgot something. We completely forgot something. From now on, customers will begin to order cocktails. Serve cocktails as requested in the right order. Okay. We completely forgot something. We should be able to rank up. Yes. Indeed we can. Excellent. Platinum acquired. Nice. And we got some new recipes. Very nice. More wasabi, more wasabi amount. I don't know what that means. Cooking slot and added interior. Okay. Okay. What about the last one then? The diamond. Yeah, that's um, definitely not going to happen on camera here, unfortunately. What will be the rewards? Interior items, more wasabi, and more recipes. Okay, let's just um, check the recipes real quick. Do have this one that only costs one? Is that uh, because it co it uh, requires Klaus's fin? Let's just get it straight away. We might as well. Yes, and. Not sure. We, we, we did get quite a few that uh, 
At least I think actually all of them is probably these six here. I'm not sure. I don't remember. It doesn't really matter. Oh, these expenses. These require 12. Onions. I don't think we can grow onions. Not yet. Atlantic, Atlantic Bonito. We haven't even seen that. Okay. Now that one is, is something we could research. We need something with a lot of taste to get to the last rank of uh, in the Cookster app. And neither of these are especially high, but maybe with an upgrade or two that might change. Oh, we can get that one as well. That would be a good one to get. We have a lot of ingredients here. The taste is a bit low compared to the others. We don't have that. We definitely don't have that. Pelican eel. Okay. Glacier Passage. Yeah, that's something we could get as well. This might be what we should go for, but... As I said, I don't think that's going to be on camera anyway. Um, we could, however, maybe get one of them anyway right now. Something where we have a lot for, so we may be able to upgrade it a little bit. It's probably going to be one of the new ones that we were just looking at. Uh, this is good as well, actually. Seven servings. That's, uh, that's real good. We have a lot of olive oil. We have a lot of wheat. We can only afford the one, so let's, uh, let's go with that one. Actually, we can afford two. But uh, neither of these are especially good. Okay. We can uh, we can do cocktails now. Okay, let's uh, let's see here. We can upgrade you. Really? I guess we can. 13 rice. That's okay. Okay. Let's uh, let's upgrade that one. Because I believe that is ten servings in one um, in one of those, so those are very good to add, and they are expensive as well. They are very expensive. Uh, seven servings. That's that's still pretty good. We can do two. Do we want to do two? Nah, I think we want to do one. Yeah, let's do one. We are not doing those because those are. For the event. What about you? You so you use rice as well. Okay, this one we are not using. We can add this one. Do five of that. We're not using these. Yeah, let's upgrade that one. Let's add five of you as well. That leaves us on 17 so far. If this one icy fish, ice fish, 15. Yeah, sure. Why not? At seven. Brings us to 24. Oh, we have a lot of this. Let's upgrade that a couple of times again, maybe. Why not? And then add five. Twenty-nine. So around like anywhere up to ten more, I would say. This one, black vinegar. That is five servings on this one. So one of those will, will do just fine. We use wheat as well. Blue spotted stargazer. Now let's not do that yet. Let's add something more or less random. We have a lot of these. Get you up there. Ooh, that got to 280 taste as well, actually. That could also get us there if we get a lot of these. Interesting. How many more do we need for the next one? 51. 360. That should be fine. Should be good to go here. I just want to check the 
what do we need to get to here? 375. Ooh, that's close. We're gonna need a lot of them for that one then. So, yeah, maybe not. Maybe it's not gonna be that one. In that case, I think we are ready to open. Now we have a... Okay, you're on that one. Yes. I got this one. I did get a comment from someone on a, a video that says that beer is a a, um, a, a two-step process. So if we get the, the chance, we might want to do that. Seen that. You are on the drink, I hope, because we need some wasabi. Oh, it's the wrong one. Okay, I'm on it. Uh... Oh, it's the wrong button. Come on. Okay. I was way too too slow there. I had no idea what to press. Okay. <clears throat> well, we got uh, 16,000 gold. It is certainly enough to... It was not a very good day, I think. 4.8. I'll take it. I thought it was a lot. Uh, thought it was a lot less. Actually, we should probably not have had so much food ready because it was a short day. I didn't see how much we how much we used. But honestly, we probably uh, we probably waste a lot of food. And I completely forgot about the fishmon. The fishmon this week, as detected by the radar, is. <gasps> What is this? A jellyfish with some kind of wizard hat. This can't be a real jellyfish. Goodness, do you doubt the accuracy of our fish radar? It was a very difficult task detecting this jellyfish with our radar. The reason was, this jellyfish teleports around at incredible speeds. It'll disappear as soon as you go near. You probably won't be able to catch it unless you have something like a sniper rifle. About 100 meter underwater, near the yellow shipwreck. That's what my information says. <laughs> now then, keep up the good work this week. Mm. Jellyfish that teleports. That is kind of interesting, I suppose. Okay, well. Let's go to the farm real quick. It is not gonna, we're not gonna do that today. We're gonna be looking for that next time. We got six eggs, very nice. And new product in stock. I wonder if that is Onions and beans, for instance. Beans and onions, yes. Let's uh, let's get some onions going then. And I think after the um, after we get the drone upgraded, I'm gonna assume that's gonna be max level now. I think we'll. Focus a little bit on upgrading the farm. How much of that we'll do on camera, I don't know. Upgrade that. Yeah. Max level, that makes sense. It was getting very expensive, so we don't have too, too much more to upgrade. Um, the crab trap could be a target, but other, other, otherwise, I think actually maybe the farm would be a good idea. Uh, for now, we will. Let's uh, not forget to check our equipment. We have the right gun. Yes, let us go to the glacial area for a quick diving session to get three sharks. And one of them at least being the, the poor beagle. Oh, we have something right there. Okay. My god, this uh, this upgraded gun is amazing. It's insane. It is so good.
I got some random fish as well. Let's check over here if there is some... Uh, what's it called? Some topaz? Whoops. There indeed there is. Let's do this. Um, sure. I always forget that they they actually need bait. Crab traps. We could uh, go to the. We have an episode going back to the glacial passage as well. I believe there should be something at least that uh, we might not have uh, have gotten. We know that at least there's the pelican, whatever fish that we need. Next time we have to go diving for the jellyfish with a wizard, with a wizard hat. But uh, and it has to be with the sniper rifle. Apparently, I was sure we, we could we could use our our dart gun here. Very nice. We are out of ammo, unfortunately. Didn't quite think that one through. Ammo in there, but that's quite far away. Got some frozen mayo. Ammo down here, maybe? No, but there's a weapons cache, maybe an upgrade kit? That's a no. Okay, we might have to go searching for it. No, that the last poor pickle actually is right there. Okay. I was about to say it's probably further up, but this may be the furthest up we can go. I don't know. Did I get it? Yes, okay. Oops. <laughs> okay. I guess we are stopping by the village as well. They're not gonna be one of the things. The uh, seahorses? Huh. Maybe not. Maybe it'll come out as we leave. Okay, maybe it's not a guarantee. Maybe it's just a chance. Okay, well, we have one more use of our drone. I don't think we can go further up here. That's where I thought the fish was, or the uh, the uh, poor beagle, shark. Yeah. And now I don't think there's anything up here. No. And we have to go a bit down to find something. This uh, tranquilizer gas. I don't think this is something new. I think it's just a special edition of, of it. Okay. Let's go find a big fish. I really don't want to fight the... the scaled one, whatever it's called. Down in the in the in the thermal area, I would much rather we can find the like the the humongous whale that's around. 
that one. That didn't hit. That did, however. Ooh. That was not good, but I think we still got yeah. It, it is an impressive drone that can that can catch that. We do need some uh, some O2 now though. Shame that there's no uh, no scooters down here. At least no guaranteed ones. I guess maybe it's something we want to buy from uh, from Cobra before we go down here. Yeah, now we know we need a lot of these. Just need that one to calm down a little bit. Go. We needed that, apparently, for the Eco app. We don't have any more crap traps. <laughs> I would like to test if these... I don't remember if these po small poisoned fish that swim around, ones that killed us... I don't remember if these are, if these are something we need the drone for, or something we can pick up ourselves. Grab you. Don't need that. No, still not you, but we will grab you. You are a rare specimen. And we will stay away from you. You uh, you just do your business. I'm going to do something else away from you. Is there no of the, the, the... It's like an eel-looking thing. I guess they, uh, they're not out at the moment. Or maybe they're just... Maybe there's one down here in the corner. Hiding away. Like that one as well. Yeah, there is one. Okay, we will learn right very quickly if you're a large fish, fish or not. Okay, you're a large fish. I cannot get you. No, okay, and we need to get out of here. I don't mind. Oh, I could press something there. I wonder what that means. Can I do something? Oh my god, you're back. And I missed. That's not good. Let's just take you out. Like that. Let's see what we can do here and then we can swim back around. There's some writing on the submarine panel. Sea blue forever. Sea blue forever. I guess they're really proud of what they do. I guess that's that's it. Okay, fair enough. Nope. Just leave you alone. I think we are pretty much done here. I just want to take a quick glance over here for any fish that we might be able to get on, on the way out here. Before we leave, yeah, something like you. And if we should find some rare fish down here, we need tons of these as well. Maybe we could find one of the pink ones down here. No, doesn't look like it. You are rare though, so let's do that. Olive oil, you can always use that. A 
Okay, well, honestly, that's uh, probably going to do it here. We will make a quick stop by the Sea People Village. Because we have some seahorses drop off. I would like to check on the farm. And we have a quest to turn in. Just get a bit of whatever random fish we can catch. do want to have enough bait left to actually harvest whatever we have in the in the in the farm in the CP C village or C people village. Uh, let's uh, let's call it a good day. Uh, yes, the C people first, please. Any missions? I don't think so. Unless there's some something new on the board here. Very nice. Well, for now that is done. Oh, now what? Is this oh my god, there's a statue in the background. Seeing a statue of me in the Sea People Village feels kind of nice, to be honest. Oh my god. We got a statue of ourselves. That's very nice. Okay, I, should, I definitely should have grabbed the, uh, the beluga whale. I always underestimate how long it actually takes to swim over here. Uh, let's see, seaweed farm, yes, everything is good to go, yes. One bonus, okay, one bonus, one bonus, and five bonus, wow. Okay, well, actually we, ha we still, we don't even need to buy anything, we still have enough. So let's just get rid of those for now. Yes, let's uh, excavate the next one. Register these. Ooh, we got we got a leafy one. I think that's our first. No, never mind. We have two already, if not more. Two already. Okay, not the first one, but always nice to get. Let's uh, hire. Yes, in with you. All the good ones get in there. Perfect. Yes, I am a lazy bastard. Let's get out of here. Well, honestly, I think uh, I don't think we have too much more to do today. Just uh, we'll go back to the boats, see if there's any events that'll happen. Otherwise, that's uh, that's gonna be it for today. And next time we will uh, we will hunt for this uh, wizard jellyfish. And maybe we will see if we can. Upgrade a sniper rifle just to make sure that we'll get it, you know. I don't know how much damage it can take. Lots of whale meat, lots and lots of whale meat. Uh, do, 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 do. Uh, weapon shop, yes. Upgrades. Let's see, the sniper rifle. I can get a level 2 one. That's good. Magazine 3. I think that's the same as the original one. Yes. But much more damage and more... No, same range. Well, we have the money for it, so why don't we go ahead and get that? Yes. And that'll probably be the last time we see... Uh, Duff do his uh, work his magic. Actually, yes, we probably should equip it. Well, we cannot get the level 3 one. That's quite okay. Maybe we should have grabbed this one instead. 
Doesn't matter. I think it'll be just fine. I just, I'm just gonna go ahead and equip it straight away so I don't forget. Uh, da -da -da -da. Red sniper rifle two. Yeah, I guess that's it. That's what we're gonna be doing. And I guess next time, unfortunately, we cannot bring our hush dart, but we'll still try to see if we can't do something with the drones, of course. Yeah, for now, thank you for watching, and until next time, take care.